Eminem may be quitting rap after this happened. Secondly, I want to remind you with a verse you did that made me want to quit rapping. Eminem is one of the greatest rappers to ever live, but even giants fall down. Stay tuned to find out why. His age. To you. Happy birthday to you. While Eminem may not be one to show off his aging self, he's definitely getting old. Going over, Dr. Dre, and then... Who's that dude? Yeah, who's that guy? Who is that guy? Oh. Eminem was born on October 17th, 1972, making him 46 years old. Just like playing a professional sport, one cannot stay in the rap game for their entire life. After his debut album, Infinite, in 1996, and Slim Shady EP, 1997, he signed with Dr. Dre's Aftermath Entertainment. To spark him even more than he's been sparked lately. You know what I'm saying? Kind of... You can push it further and just... And subsequently achieved mainstream popularity in 1999 with the Slim Shady LP, which earned him his first Grammy Award for Best Rap Album. His next two releases, the 2000 Marshall Mathers LPs, the 2002 Eminem Show, were worldwide successes, and each one being certified diamond in the United States, and both winning the Best Rap Album Grammy Awards. All right, what's up, Emmy? Um, I guess, first of all, I want to thank making him the first artist to win the award three consecutive occasions. As you can tell, Eminem has been in the rap game for a long time now. He went on hiatus touring in 2005, releasing Relapse in 2009, and Recovery in 2010, won both Grammy Awards for Recovery, and was the best-selling album of 2010 worldwide. Okay. The second time he had the international best-selling album of the year after the Eminem show. His eighth album, 2013's Marshall Mathers LP 2, won two Grammy Awards, including Best Rap Album, and it expended his record for the most wins in that category, and his Grammy totaled to 15. However, while he still puts his name out there, it seems like Eminem sort of dropped off a bit ever since his glory days. Take Snoop Dogg, for example. At 46 years old, he's still going at it, but we can definitely see that he's dropped off a little bit. I could predict that Snoop Dogg won't be around the rap scene for much longer, at least on the side of putting out music. Eminem might be a bit more active in the game, but we can't say that he's going to keep it up for years and years to come. He's gone through a lot in his time, from growing up in the streets of Detroit to making millions, and Eminem has had a long but amazing run. He is the best hip hop. Eminem. Eminem. And while we hate to say it, he could be just coming to an end soon. He's accomplished so much over the many years that he's been in the game, and retiring wouldn't be a bad option. The rise of mumble rap. MGK's 2012 tweet about Eminem's daughter Haley likely had him blacklisted by Shade 45. Some say it's for the better, and some say it's for the worse. But over the past few years, rappers such as Lil Yachty, Lil Pump, and many more have gained the attention from audiences all over the world due to its newer style of rapping, which is known as mumble rap. However, Eminem is one of the few rappers to stick to his roots and not rap about girls, money, and fame. Eminem is known for his fast flows, his quality music, and the relatability his lyrics provide. While longtime fans of Eminem know that he's genuine to himself, it may not be long before for the entire mumble train takes over the rap game, and Eminem falls off completely. We can already see this starting to take over, and it may be another reason why Eminem is going to quit his rap career. Eminem definitely is not one to transfer over to the mumble side of rap, as he just does not fit that category. So what does this mean? Well, maybe the old school rap will work out, or Eminem may quit. This has been a topic of discussion for a while now, as many fans have wanted to see Eminem bring back the OG modern rap back. And while he's tried to do so, it hasn't really worked out too well. This could be a big factor in why Eminem is going to stop rapping. He's made enough money to support himself. As we talked about earlier, Eminem has already made enough money to retire. With multiple Grammy Awards and Billboard topping albums, the rapper has pretty much set records in the rap world. With all this comes a lot of money. Let's talk about retirement for a second here. As goes with any career, people tend to retire once they're financially supportive of themselves. The age can come early or it can come later for different people, depending on how successful they are. Many rappers have the opportunity to retire whenever they like, as they make a lot of money selling records, performing, and from digital streams. However, most decide not to because why not make more cash? But for Eminem, he's already so much older than most of the popular rappers of the current age, so what does this mean? Well, it could be a sign that it is in fact time for the legend to retire. However, it seems like he's still going strong. But from what we've seen recently, I really wouldn't be surprised if he decided to stop his career altogether to find a nice place to retire. I mean, in all honesty, who wouldn't give up the opportunity to relax all day in your dream home without worrying about expenses? Don't get me wrong, I definitely don't want Eminem to retire, but come on, he already has so much money that it may be a good option. Let us know in the comments down below what you would do in his situation right now he's quit before yeah so that made me want to stop rapping take it back years ago and was sent to a rehab clinic and his dependency to sleep medication tell us what comes across your mind when you see that 
Kids don't do drugs. In 2006, he remarried and then divorced his ex-wife, Kim Scott, the subject of many of his most violent songs. And that same year, his closest friend, the rapper Proof, had his life taken at a Detroit nightclub. This led the rapper to taking a five-year break from the scene. You know, being, or even harder, being how close he was, but you know, that didn't matter. Everybody took it hard. Which had fans worrying about what was to come. Was he quitting? Did he pass away? What happened? In this time of his hiatus, many other rappers we know to this day took over the scene and thus Mumble Rap was formed. So the question is, what would rap be like if Eminem hadn't taken his long break? Would we have kept the old rap style alive or would he have dropped off the charts? I hate to say it, but this break kind of messed up a lot of the old school rap style that many people love. And while others enjoy the new rap, it's definitely not the same. Either way, this could be another big reason for Eminem to quit his rap career as a whole. His newest album was supposed to bring back the old Slim Shady. Yo, man, we going to the studio or what? Yeah, let's go. Let's, hold on. When Eminem's surprise Kamikaze album arrived about five months ago, one name stood out in the credits. Ella, the producer, is credited with production on four tracks, more than anyone else other than Eminem himself. The beatmaker, the real name Ella Frazier, is partially responsible for three of the first four songs. His brawling beats helped set the album's feisty tone. Many longtime Eminem fans were ecstatic at the release of the album, believing it would revive the old Eminem we know and love. However, it hasn't really been done so. And not to mention, M hasn't released an album ever since. He even dropped some sneak disses on rappers like Lil Pump and Lil Yachty, and other mumble rappers. The prize album Kamikaze is on a crash course for a lot of artists. First up, he continues his assault on the new generation of rappers. Clearly, Eminem was trying to bring back his OG style and bring back what his longtime fans loved, but did it really work out? I'm not sure. When this album took off immediately with many worldwide plays and tons of support, nothing big has been released since then. So was Kamikaze supposed to be M's test to the world as to whether he should keep on going or not? Yeah, that's what some people are thinking. All in all, if this didn't work out, should Eminem retire? He has many children. My main like, source of drive and motivation especially when she was first born. The family life of Eminem was reflected in his older song. He sang about his troubled childhood and even about the pregnancy of his girlfriend, Kim. Kim soon gave birth to the rapper's only daughter, Haley Jade. Oh, that's always, she's always been the driving force for me to like stay busy, stay, stay focused. Haley J was born on the 25th of December, 1995, when their parents were still unmarried. She's a student now. Eminem likes his daughter greatly, and Haley's name appears in at least 22 songs of the star. Eminem is definitely not your typical father and family man anyway, and while there are plenty of other celebrity children who move on and become Insta celebrities or reality TV stars, that's just not the case for Eminem and his three daughters, Haley Jade, Whitney Scott Mathers, and Elenia Mary Mathers. His family life is the most important thing for him, and throughout the years, he's done a good job of keeping his kids on track, despite of all that he has going on. But is this time commitment worth considering that he's pretty old for the rap scene? Yeah, I don't know. But it could just be another big reason why Eminem is wanting to quit rap. His fans are saying it's time to quit. Longtime Eminem fans are starting to realize that he's just getting a bit too old to keep up with all that is going on in the rap world. And while people still love the rapper greatly, many think that it's time for him to retire and keep his name as the king of rap. This is due to the fact that M hasn't really released any singles or albums in the few past months. Because of the success of the hit album Kamikaze, they think that it may be a great stop before for him to unwind and live his life freely. But on the other hand, some believe that he should keep on going and push for the revival of the old rap that he's brought to the table. So let us know what you guys think about this thought. Should Eminem let Kamikaze be the end or should he keep on dropping albums? He's had a lot of beefing recently. Path anyway. And I had just had this like the, this whole week was, you know, all the energy was spent beefing with this dude. Because of his call-outs on Kamikaze, many of the new school rappers have fired shots back at M. This has led to many new listeners hopping on the train and hitting on Eminem. But as a real fan would know, Eminem is responsible for bringing rap to the world as we know it. I hate to see these young fans bashing someone as talented as Eminem, but I guess that's just how it goes in the world. Yeah, I don't know. Good thing for Eminem though, he doesn't seem to let this beef get to him. Deep down, he knows that without himself, rap wouldn't be the same. And as a long rap listener, I can confirm that is completely true. Anyway, this may or may not be the reason why Eminem wants to quit rapping. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Has he quit already? Recently, a big conspiracy that has been going around that M has already quit rapping, but continues to push out already recorded music for his fans' pleasure. Now, the evidence is not 100% sure there, but it's definitely something to consider. But some people believe that his newest album, Kamikaze, was made years ago and was just dropped recently. As we covered earlier, this album features the old Eminem, which people know as Slim Shady. So why would a new album be of an old rapping style? Yeah, well, maybe I made it years ago and wanted to put it out now as a message to his fans that he's quitting. Don't 
Don't take what I just said and believe it 100%. But I think it's a possibility, and thanks to Twitter, we're able to figure out what some fans think. Either way, do you think that this is all true or just a conspiracy that has been taken over? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, and I'll see you next time. Hey, just a reminder that we're changing up the giveaways. From now on, we're offering the Galaxy Note 9, the one that comes with the exclusive Fortnite skin, the new iPhone X Max, which we'll pre-order for you, and the new Apple Watch Series 4, which we'll also pre-order for you. The winner gets to decide between these three, Make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, drop a like, and comment the hidden message in the video for a chance to win. You got nothing to lose. Go for it.